Hello my friends! Welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie and if you are new here, hi, welcome! I hope you'll consider subscribing and if you are back, welcome back! Today I am here with a special sneak peek unboxing for a midweek release from Diamond Art Club. This is part of their partnership with Warner Brothers, specifically with DC Comics. And you guys, I have a really, really adorable snack size kit I get to share with you all today. Now, this kit is going to be released tomorrow, which is Wednesday, September 28th. And I believe that it's going to go live at 9 a.m. Pacific time or noon Eastern for everyone. The release times can vary a little bit with these midweek releases, so I will double check on that. And once Diamond Art Club has made their official social media announcement and preview, I will be sure to update the description box below so that it reflects the most accurate and most recent information. <laughs> so um, if you have any confusion, if there's any confusion about it, be sure to check in the description box below this video and that'll have that for you. But anyway, you're already getting a look at the original artwork here. But this is the absolutely adorable Be Your Own Hero. And we have Wonder Woman here. And you guys, I have a really incredibly beginner-friendly kit in this box that we'll get into in just a minute. But we have all of the official branding for Wonder Woman and DC Comics. So all of this is done above board. While you might often see really popular IPs like superheroes, Warner Brothers, you know, Wonder Woman, that kind of thing stolen. Diamond Art Club has legally licensed this artwork from Warner Brothers. This kit's going to have square shaped diamonds in it. Here's the title, Be Your Own Hero. The size is going to be 13 by 13 inches or 33 by 33 centimeters. Um, if you look on the side of the box here, sorry for that little bit of glare there, you can see this is going to have 13 colors, including two Aurora Borealis colors. If you're not sure what those are, stay tuned. I will show you. Tells us the exact number of diamonds if you're curious. Um, you're gonna see again, they kind of they wrap the artwork around the box. They do this really special branding for these boxes. That's a look at what the toolkit inside is gonna be. And then on the back, there's information about how to diamond paint and your kit contents, and of course, some more Wonder Woman branding. So let's go ahead and open this up and take a look at what is in here. So, how are you guys doing today? I hope your day is off to a wonderful start. If you're brand new to Diamond Art Club and thinking of making your very first purchase, if you want to save 20% off your first purchase, I have an affiliate discount code that's for first time buyers that you're welcome to use. It's my name, Katie, K-A-T-I-E, and the number 20. If you use that code, you'll get 20% off your first purchase. Please don't feel obligated though. It is an affiliate code, so I may make a small commission. You're gonna see several discount codes just in the course of this unboxing. So even if you don't use my code, no worries. Um, there's lots of other codes. I encourage you to use at least one of them so that you are saving a bit on your purchase. <laughs> Here we've got a toolkit, even the small snack size paintings are still going to come with a complete toolkit. Um, this is the newer version of their toolkit. You might get this one or there is there's an older version that's still floating around out there in some of their kits and either way it's going to have everything you need to do your diamond painting but these newer toolkits have some extra bonus goodies that I'll show you. So first uh, you're going to get a pen and a squishy that you can slide on there. We also have some thin plastic multi-placers, which you can pop in the end to try placing one more, more than one diamond at a time. You're also gonna get a pair of tweezers with any of the Diamond Art Club kits that have square diamonds in them. So they are sharp though, so make sure you, you keep that cover on when you're not using them. You're also going to get a tray, and this bit in the end is actually a stopper that you can pop in and out. They both are clear with gold sparkles. <laughs> You're also going to get some pink wax in this cute little caddy. I always like to remind people, especially beginners, that um, there is a thin plastic film that covers these. You can kind of see it. Make sure you peel that off before you try to load up your pen with that wax. <laughs> You're also going to get some plastic baggies that you can put your diamonds into, um, like kit up into them, or you can store leftovers in. These two things here are the uh, wild cards, and they're exclusive to the newer toolkits. So 
This is a roll of washi tape, and this is what we call a cover minder. Cover minders have magnets on the back, and if you slide the one off, put that under the area of the canvas that you're working on, and then set this on top of the plastic cover you've peeled back, and it will hold back the plastic cover for you. That's a really cute design. <laughs> and then the washi tape, I like to run it around the border of my painting, right up against the drill field, so that any glue that kind of goes a little bit past the edge of the drill field and isn't going to be covered by diamonds, um, is covered by washi tape and won't get dirt or dust in it. So the print and style on these may vary a bit, but there you go. <laughs> also included in Diamond Art Club's toolkits are these smaller stickers. So it has all the information about the kit on it. I like to use these in my paper logbook once I start working on a kit. And I mean, you can do whatever you like with this, but I like it has that it has the original artwork and all the info on it. Everything else is going to be in this branded dust cover or bag. <laughs> Let's take a look. It's so little. All right. So we have this absolutely adorable little kit. Look at that. Be your own hero and all of that pink in the background. I love it. Look at the diamonds here in just a little bit. Uh, Diamond Art Club includes a pamphlet with your kit that includes a thank you note on the front from the founder and some info about what's included, some step-by-step -step instructions. I also have a beginner video that I'll link to below. The VIP Facebook group is a really wonderful resource. Once you've made your first purchase, be sure to join the Facebook group. Here's some step-by-step -step instructions and some tips and tricks written out for you and of um, a discount code. Like I said, you're gonna see lots, <laughs> including when you download the mobile app, which you can do um, iPhone, Android. <laughs> Your first purchase through the app, you'll get 20% off. So lots and lots of ways that you can save a little bit of money. You're also gonna get this larger sticker sheet. It's got the title, info about the licensing. So this is by WB Wonder Woman Core and start and end date, a spot to write those. Here is the original artwork again and the info about the kit. <laughs> over here is a set of pre-cut stickers. The color code you see over here, this is the same as the DMC color code. Diamond Art Club uses this color coding system with all their kits, most diamond painting companies do. And um, the exception though is with Diamond Art Club's kits, any numbers under the number 150, like these two, are gonna be a special kind of diamond called an Aurora Borealis diamond or an AB. So just like we saw on the outside of the box, if you're not sure what those are, like I said, stay tuned. I'll go over it in more depth once we're looking at the actual diamonds. But the other nice thing is that these are all pre-cut for you. So if you were to um, put your diamonds into storage containers or into baggies, you can just go ahead and put these stickers on your storage containers or baggies and that helps organize your diamonds for you. So let's look at the canvas. First, I am gonna roll it backwards to help it lay flat. Uh, this is normal this kind of just happens in packing and transit sometimes and if you're seeing what looks like wrinkles on the canvas there are not any actual wrinkles that's just where the plastic cover shifted just a little bit in transit all right so rolling it backwards is one way to help it lay flat the other way and this also helps just with like i said any any wrinkles that you feel like you're seeing this aesthetically kind of helps with it and it helps it lay flat. I peel back the plastic cover halfway going each direction and that usually helps it lay flat that much more quickly. Now Diamond Art Club's canvases do have a self-flattening feature and um, so it would lay flat on its own eventually but I am not a patient person. So <laughs> here at the top we have their branding, Do It Makes You Sparkle, Diamond Art Club and the edges of the canvas are scalloped and finished. Uh, so you're not gonna have to worry about any fraying or anything like that. Um, they have a really nice soft backing. It's almost plush to the touch. And um, they use poured glue on their canvases, which is the other reason that it's safe to roll back the opposite direction. They use a really nice high quality poured glue. It's, it's really squishy to the touch. So between that and how plush the canvases are, it's like you're diamond painting on a cloud. <laughs> the glue also has a really pretty like sparkly effect, which is fun. Up here at the top left, we have a legend or a key code. And we have the same thing over here at the bottom right. At the bottom left, there's the thumbnail of the original artwork and then all the info about the, the title, the size and the licensing again. So Diamond Art Club does legally license all of their artwork 
including this one. <laughs> Here we have information and links to their socials. Be sure to follow there so you can stay up to date with their new releases and all of the latest announcements. Here's another discount code. And here's info on their lifetime warranty. As long as you're the orig original owner and purchaser of your kit, you're covered under that lifetime warranty. It includes if you um, run out of any diamonds, if you run into any trouble with your canvas or the glue or anything at all, you're covered under that lifetime warranty. I'm gonna measure and make sure that we are measuring true to size for what's listed. We are at just a tiny tick shy of 33 centimeters left to right and a tiny tick shy of 13, 33 centimeters, 13 inches up and down. So I am considering that true to size. I give companies a little bit of wiggle room when it comes to um, the dimensions. But if you take a look up close, you can see the symbols are printed very clearly. And this canvas has oodles of what we call, often in the community, <laughs> call color blocking. Color blocking is when you have sections of uh, like this, where you've got all of this one symbol right here. An even better example is the background, all this one symbol. We call that color blocking, um, and those tend to go a lot more quickly than sections with a lot of color changes. If you like to use a multi-placer, you can use like one of the ones that came with the kit. You can use that through these areas. That color will be in your tray for a bit longer. Generally, those areas just tend to go faster than areas of what we call confetti. In this kit, there's not really gonna be a great example. <laughs> the closest I can probably find. So you see we have some more color changes in her outfit and maybe in her face with her eyes and her lips and her headpiece. Um, there's a little bit more in the way of color changes there. That's probably technically what we would call confetti. So you'll be mostly single placing those spots, changing the color in your tray a bit more often. Not a huge deal, honestly. It gives it a little bit more detail when you have confetti. But this kit is so beginner friendly with all the color blocking that there is. I bet that this would work up really, really quickly. Not that diamond painting should be about how quickly you finish a painting, but sometimes it's nice to have a smaller, quicker kit in your stash. And I feel like this could be one of those kinds of kits. So <laughs> let me go ahead and show you the diamonds. So we have our cute little pack of diamonds here. There's a sticker on the package. So if you store these separate from um, the canvas and like outside of the box they came in, you can match them up easily later. So this is a cute little pack. <laughs> of course, this first set of diamonds that we have a bunch of. This is gonna be our background color, which is DMC, the color code 963. It's a nice pale pink. And Diamond Art Club started manu manufacturing their diamonds in house last year. And these new diamonds are um, really, really nice. I feel like, especially their squares, they are all like a lot more consistent in shape. They're really sparkly, just really, really nice to work with. Next up here is 132. This is actually our first AB diamond. AB, like I mentioned earlier, stands for Aurora Borealis. And these get their name from the Northern Lights. Just like the Northern Lights have a really pretty sparkly or shimmery or color shift effect, um, that's what's happening on the special coating on these diamonds. You can see how it's super, super, super sparkly, even more so than regular diamonds are. The areas these have been charted are gonna draw your eye to them and um, are gonna highlight those areas. And occasionally you'll even have some, oh my camera doesn't wanna pick it up. Uh, there was one that it was like the bottom looked like it had the AB coating instead of the top. That happens sometimes too. But anyway, um, I really like the way that Diamond Art Club tends to use ABs. It tends to uh, elevate paintings nicely. And I bet it's going to look really nice and sparkly in this painting. So I'll show you where that AB is going to go after we're done looking at all the colors. 38, 49, 133. That's our second AB. Also an orange AB. So we have two orange ABs in this kit. Uh, a darker and a lighter. This is the darker one. Love that extra sparkle. Mm. 336, 3824, 3808, 603, 3326, 598, 3865, 3846, and then 666. Just a little bit of that red, probably in her lips, I bet. <laughs> All right, so you guys, we have those two orange ABs, and if we're taking a look, um, the lighter orange AB is in the letter E. It's in the orange coloring, the lighter orange coloring on her boots. 
the lasso of truth is orange ABs. Um, all of that yellowish orange that's um, doing like some details in her skirt, like the bottom part of her what she's wearing, are that lighter orange AB. And then the top of her bodice is or light orange AB, as is her armband and her headband as well, are all the lighter orange AB. This letter E is as well. And these little lightning bolts <laughs> and then this star down here those are all the lighter orange ab and then the darker orange ab is the dark color that almost i feel like is an optical illusion with the pink behind it and the light orange next to it this almost looks red but it's a dark orange it, and so that's the darker orange ab right here next to the light orange ab the darker orange ab is the letter o right here and the letter o right here and the star right here it's also this darker part, sorry for the glare, the darker part of her bodice and the middle, the star <laughs> on her headpiece. So lots and lots and lots of ABs. It's really gonna help those parts stand out and is gonna make it just super, super, super sparkly. So you guys, this is the absolutely adorable Be Your Own Hero. Um, this is from Diamond Art Club, licensed from Warner Brothers, and will be releasing tomorrow, which is Wednesday, September 28th at 9 a.m. Pacific time. But check below in the description box in case there's, a, there's any confusion or there's been a change. Um, and that's noon Eastern. And uh, I'm not sure whether or not this one is going to be listed as limited edition. If it is, that means that once it sells out, it will not be restocked. So if you're looking at this and going, I need this for myself or I need this for someone that I know loves Wonder Woman and is, a, you know, maybe new to diamond painting. This would be like a really like, I don't know, teen friendly or even like younger kid friendly uh, kit as well. I definitely recommend um, using this one as a beginner kit or even if you're a seasoned diamond painter, it's really nice to have smaller snack size kits in your stash as well so uh, yeah check in at release time though if you think you're going to want this one for yourself or for someone else um because if it is limited edition it may sell out quickly and then it won't be restocked and i'd be sad if you missed out so anyway you guys i hope that this sneak peek unboxing video was helpful <laughs> looking at this really adorable kit be your own hero let me know if you have any questions below but otherwise, best of luck to you shopping. I hope you're having an amazing day. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, would you mind giving it a thumbs up before you head out? And if you're not already subscribed and wanna see lots more diamond painting content from me, feel free to subscribe. I'd absolutely love to have you as part of my community here. All right, my friends, have a great rest of your day and I'll chat with you in the next one. Bye.